ChemCam is an instrument that is going on the 2009 Mars Science Laboratory rover. It is a, considered a remote sensing instrument, which means that it's going to look at rocks and soils some distance away from the rover. This works by actually focusing a telescope on the rock or sample that we're interested in. It then fires a number of laser shots. Then uh, INI is a part of the material of the rock or soil, and it uh, then produces a flash of light because these uh, ionized and electronically excited atoms and, and ions decay back to ground state, and you have a little ball of plasma. And this plasma then is viewed by the telescope and uh, some spectrometers that we use, and we break down the light into characteristic emission lines. Those emission lines tell us exactly what elements are present in these rocks and at what abundances. Part of the problem of previous rovers and uh, analytical instruments that have done remote sensing is that most of the rocks are covered with dust and often with a little bit of a weathering layer of sorts. And when you just take an image of the rocks, you get just the outer surface, whether it's dust or the weathering layer. What is really inside the rock is what we're interested in. And so the first laser shots that we use can actually remove the dust and the weathering layers. And when you just take an image of the rocks, you get just the outer surface, whether it's dust or the weathering layer. What is really inside the rock is what we're interested in. And so the first laser shots that we use can actually remove the dust and the weathering layers so that we're seeing what's inside the rock from a distance. This is the first active remote sensing instrument that we'll be using on Mars.